Hi guys, Assalamualaikum Ok, hari ni Miharu akan buat uh, breakdown untuk announcement yang telah dibuat oleh Sony Pictures uh, di CinemaCon yang berlangsung di Las Vegas Caesar Palace pada minggu ini So, kalau korang nak tahu CinemaCon dia macam any other convention dekat, U, uh, dekat US such as New York Comic Con, uh, San Diego Comic Con but CinemaCon is mostly about cinema and what's coming in the movie industry lah Okay and first panel ataupun presentation yang telah dibuat pada pagi ini adalah Sony Pictures Dan kita tahu Sony Pictures merupakan uh, company yang banyak juga IP-IP dia Okay one of the popular IP of course are Spider-Man You know um, Ghostbusters So hari ni ada beberapa announcement terbaru Yang telah di dropkan oleh Sony ketika Diorang punya presentation dekat CinemaCon Of course the first thing first Is uh, Across the Spider-Verse telah ditayangkan selama 15 minit Kepada pengunjung di CinemaCon Okay maybe ramai yang tak tanya Miaru Adakah kita akan tengok this 15 minutes? I don't think so Kita akan tengok the first trailer yes But this 15 minutes adalah khas untuk pengunjung CinemaCon Sebab everyone who want to visit CinemaCon They need to pay for the ticket So sebagai macam exchange Apa benefit yang korang dah beli tiket tu Sony memberikan Early screening Sebagai contoh ni 15 minit untuk Across the Spider-Verse lah When it comes to the footage across the Spider-Verse Dikatakan dikatakan Dekat dalam tu ada Miles Morales uh, Miguel O'Hara Of course uh, Spider-Man uh, Oscar Isaac And lepas tu katanya Ada uh, Jessica Drew Who was pregnant Naik motor Tengah berlawan dengan Vulture Okay And ada Gwen uh, Stacy juga Okay Spider Gwen So dekat sini merupakan The 15 minutes awal Untuk uh, This movie And dikatakan juga This movie going to be A big Movie daripada uh, The first one Iaitu Into the Spider-Verse Across the Spider-Verse Going to take around 240 character In total dalam movie ni Dan akan to place Dalam 6 universes Yang berlainan And the crew Yang behind the scene Untuk buat movie ni Is going to be bigger dan uh, Bukan is going to be bigger Dan memang bigger Than uh, Into the Spider-Verse lah Okay so itu merupakan Um Apa yang dah dia di, di announcekan hari ni Dan orang juga announce The next movie which is the third movie Kita tahu yang Across the Spider-Verse Going to have dual part which is First part and second part But the third movie setelah Across the Spider-Verse Is going to be Spider-Man Beyond the Spider-Verse Okay so when it comes to this It made me wonder adakah Beyond the Spider-Verse tu maksudnya Beyond animation we're going Into live action is going to be One of the big uh, crossover juga Maybe Miharu tak tahu Allah alam. Maybe in the end of the day The most more or less yang kita kenal Dalam animation ni going into Live action Yeah sorry Miles I'm not, I'm not gonna make it Yeah I'm just stuck so kita tahu dia orang dah dropkan Mas Morales into uh, dalam Spider-Man No Way Home hari tu. So sekarang ni adakah kita kata Mas Morales terus masuk dekat dalam live action mungkin and yang yang Miaru tahu dia orang akan release uh, Beyond the Spider-Verse pada 29 March 2024. Okay, it's going to take a, it's going to be a long ride by Miaru tak sabar. Okay, the second thing is um Tak adalah besar sangat the announcement but Venom tengah develop uh, in development sekarang ni Venom 3 okay and ada juga dia orang tunjuk footage Craven the Hunter dan kita tahu uh, gambar Craven the Hunter dah keluar untuk set foto dia uh, Aaron Taylor Johnson as uh, Craven kita dapat tengok dia berlari dia pakai that white shirt oh my god he is so cute <laughs> and um yeah, Miharu tak sabar tengok Craven and Venom dah confirm And then there's another Salah satu daripada uh, Spider-Man punya villain iaitu El Muerto uh, Merupakan uh, villain yang akan mendapat his own movie Sekarang ni diorang tengah tap this one guy who play dekat dalam cerita Bullet Train Bullet Train ni yang dengan uh, Brad Pitt Yang akan keluar pada Julai nanti I'm going to talk about Bullet Train later But that this one guy And uh, he's a Latino rapper Yang dinamakan um, Yang dinamakan Bad Bunny Dan dia telah di tap untuk jadi El Muetro Miaru tak sama nak tengok juga uh, Miaru tak tahu nak komen macam mana sangat about this movie For me kan Sony kena I know diorang nak buat Sinister Six And penuh kan Dia universe with all the villains So that Spider-Man boleh berlawan But take 
like take a step back kejap uh, Tengok Mobius macam mana Like look at what Mobius did Try to uh, Jangan repeat benda tu lah Okay I always support them You know I always support like this movie studios Who wants to create more Or give opportunity more to people But you guys need to Take Mobius as a lesson and not to Repeat it again because it's going to be hard Because we know how comp How limited Mobius was Diorang tak boleh nak pakai karakter tu, tak boleh nak pakai karakter ni So they need to really plan betul-betul Lagi-lagi -betul. when it comes to villain-villain yang macam bukanlah main villain Macam kalau kita tahu Venom, people already know Venom Almetro like, oh, you know, kita kena start belajar balik Tak ada masalah nak belajar, tak ada masalah But to kenalkan orang yang tak the reputation sangat Dekat dalam cinematic universe going to be a challenge But I know y'all can do it and I believe in y'all But please Remember, ambil Mobius sebagai pengajaran. Ha, macam tu, okay. So, the third one, of course, the bullet train. Yang Miharu cakap pasal movie tu, bullet train, orang ada tunjuk sikit action. Dan, of course, orang akan release pada Julai tahun ni. It's going to be Cyberpunk is Japanese punya, uh, team punya movie. Di mana kita tahu dekat Japan, bullet train, orang laju apa semua. So, this movie going to take place in futuristic bullet train. So, yeah, itu satu. Ada second lagi sebelum diorang tutup diorang punya panel Diorang tunjuk yang Ghostbuster tengah, uh, The next Ghostbuster which is the sequel for Afterlife is going to happen Bagi Miharu sekarang ni Sony tengah rasa semangat Because they put faith in their staff, in their IP Bukan saja Spider-Man je They put faith in Ghostbuster Sebab kita Ghostbuster got a good result Got a good review I, I indeed I enjoy it You know so macam Miharu tak sabar tengok But jangan overconfident lah Like y'all please don't Uh You know, try to put everything in one stuff Without thinking about the consequences Because we don't want another Mobius happen Itu je Like, I really can't wait with all this announcement Like, man, across the Spider-Verse 15 minit dah keluar And then like, beyond the Spider-Verse Maybe sebagai hint yang Life Fashion Mass Moralize is coming So, macam, memanglah Life Fashion Mass Moralize is coming But, is bagi kita lagi macam Confirmation yang betul Mas Morales is coming you, you all just need to wait Macam tu So maybe perhaps We're going to see Mas Morales 24 2024 and beyond For live action So yeah It was it was a good presentation for them So Mihara akan cover The next movie presentation uh, Which is kalau ada besok Sebab petani Mihara Going to berbuka with Disney Plus So by the time This video dah pop up I might not be at home So I hope you guys enjoy This announcement So Mihara tak sabar tengok Craven Like if you guys ask me Siapa Mihara tak sabar tengok Craven the Hunter Because Aaron is putting So much effort And um, Mihara rasa yakin lah Dengan dia So Mihara tak sabar nak tengok dia In action And of course Miharu tak sabar Nak tengok banyak lagi lah Jessica Drew Even though In live action pun Miharu rasa macam Yes I Miharu tak sabar Macam tu okay So that's it guys uh, I hope you guys like it uh, Nanti kita akan borak lagi Dalam the next video So take care Be careful Stay safe Assalamualaikum Bye guys